Welcome to part one of the Digital Electronics Whiteboard Talks. In this video, you will learn about event processing in systems running on BDFAX Diva software. How are events processed in BDFAX Diva systems? Let's talk about the creation of a voltage pulse, how threshold, window gate, and window extension are related to each other, and how the system processes events and electronic aborts. The creation of a voltage pulse starts in the flow cell at the point where the laser intercepts the cell or particle. As this particle passes through the laser, a signal is created. This signal over time is described as a voltage pulse. The signal is digitized by measuring the height of the pulse at set intervals of time. To determine if a signal is significant, a threshold is applied. Measurements that are below the threshold will be ignored. The period of time that the pulse is above threshold is the window gate. Any signal measured during this time period makes up the area of the signal. However, a portion of the voltage pulse is below threshold, resulting in an incomplete measurement of the area of that pulse. To measure the complete area of the voltage pulse, the window gate can be extended by a set amount of time. This is the window extension. The window extension will be applied to the window gate anytime a signal crosses threshold, which allows the system to accurately measure the total area of the voltage pulse. When running sample at a high event rate, the cells might arrive at the laser very close to each other. If two pulses are close enough that the window extensions overlap, those signals cannot be processed and both are discarded as an electronic abort. Voltage pulses that are well separated from neighboring pulses will result in a processed event. One reason you might see a high electronic abort rate is a low threshold setting, which might allow the system to count debris as events. A high electronic abort rate could also be due to a high event rate, which can be controlled either by adjusting the flow rate on the instrument or the cell concentration of the sample. It could also be due to a window extension, which is set larger than it needs to be, causing more events to be aborted. This concludes part one of the Digital Electronics Whiteboard Talks. For more information on digital electronics, refer to the BDFAX Diva Option White Paper or your instrument's user's guide. Be sure to view parts two and three of this series as well. Thanks for watching.